This is Dave with DBW Productions. Today I'm going to show you how to export a song out of Logic and import it into Pro Tools with a conductor track and markers. The first thing you want to do is make sure that your MIDI files are joined together. Also make sure everything's labeled correctly. The next thing you want to do is make a Pro Tools session. It's going to be blank. It's going to have the same exact settings as I used in Logic. In this case, it's 44K and 24-bit. I can now go back to Logic and export my audio files. I pick a location. In this case, I'm going to save them into my Pro Tools project file that I just created in that project's audio folder. That's going to save me a step later on. Finally, I want to export the MIDI tracks. Some people like to re-trigger MIDI files, and I want to give them the option to do that. I go and I export all MIDI files, making sure that they're all selected. And once again, I'm going to choose the Pro Tools folder as my location. I now go into Pro Tools and import the MIDI file I just made. That's going to give me my conductor track, my markers, and my MIDI files. The last thing I need to do is drag in my audio files from the Pro Tools audio folder. Just make sure that you line them up from measure 1, 1, 0, 0, 0. Feel free to put a click track in there too. Everything looks good and is lining up and playing correctly. Thanks for watching, and make sure you go to dbwproductions.com for all your high quality music production needs. <laughs>